GM, GA, GE, wherever you may be. I'm Lou, and today on Lucky Trader, I'll be going over how to use your Premint NFT Pass. Premint is a way for collectors and creators to connect to be able to sign up for pre sale access lists, giveaways, find new projects that you might not have heard of that are available through the website for people who are holding Premint NFTs. All right, so let's see what you can do on Premint. First thing you're going to want to do is get yourself a Premint collector pass. There are some access lists that are available to people without a pass. More of the accessibility is through people that own a Premint NFT. Once you have a pass, you can go to Premint.xyz. In our case, you're going to go to slash collectors page, connect your Ethereum wallet. So I'm going to connect to MetaMask. A pop-up will come up asking for a signature request to assure to the website that I own one of those premium NFTs. You don't have to pay a gas fee. It's just a signature request. So the homepage for collectors looks like this. There is inbox, collabs, calendar, discounts, and explore. We will go over each of those tabs now. Inbox is where you're going to be able to see all the projects that you submitted a, a registration for. Under projects one, you will also notice some of these passes come out with a wait list. If you're not a winner of the spot, you will then be on the wait list in case not everybody who won ends up using their spot. And then lost projects come under projects lost. Next, we'll head over to the collabs tab. See at the top, the collab council picks. These are ones that the collab council group of people who decide which projects they believe are somewhat higher caliber. Then below, you'll see the top collector pass collabs. This shows you basically what has higher demand at this time. If I go into Corner Boys Club, you need to hold a premint collector pass that will be connected to the wallet that you are currently signed into. This one is requiring that you have to have at least 0 0.0001 Ethereum in your wallet in order to sign up. And these are ways to get around bots. So you'll see the mint price, mint date, how many spots are reserved, website info, and then a little bit about what the actual project is. Calendar tab, you'll be able to subscribe your personal calendar connected with the premint calendar. So in this case, I would just take this, copy paste this URL from premint and add that to my own calendar on Google Calendar, Apple Calendar, whichever one you have. And then you'll be able to see the feed of mint dates that are coming up for you. The discounts page is a place where you'll be able to see collector discounts are available to premint pass holders. They offered a Ledger Nano S Plus. That offer has already ended on May 17th, but there's some other cool stuff that they have available. There's 10% off coin tracker on NFT HUD. You have Moby, NFT nerds, NFT scoring. So this is a place where you can see what other sort of benefits are available to the premint pass holders. The last tab here is called the explore tab. You're able to see what sort of stuff is trending in the top projects here the newest stuff, what has recently been added. Sometimes there are projects that go on premint and only have one hour, three hour window that you can sign up. So sometimes it's good to watch the newest tab. This is for people that maybe you want to be in something that isn't a collab and you've heard about it. You want to be able to sign up and find that specific project. You would do that in the Explorer tab. We have another video that down with Brendan Mulligan, who is the founder of premint where we went over some of the stuff you can expect in the future for your premint pass. If you like this content, you want to see more, we have some other videos over at Lucky Trader DeFi and NFT. Check out everything else we have to offer.